Welcome to our Bible Quiz channel. Today, we embark on a journey through the life of Abraham, the father of faith, with 50 comprehensive questions. This quiz covers key events such as God's promises to Abraham, the birth of Isaac, and the test of Abraham's faith. You'll encounter questions about Abraham's journey, his covenant with God, and the significant moments that defined his relationship with God. Each question is designed to test your knowledge and deepen your understanding of Abraham's pivotal role in biblical history. Before we begin, please subscribe and like this video. Your support helps us continue spreading the message of the Bible and bringing you more engaging content. Are you ready to delve into the life of Abraham and test your biblical knowledge? Let's get started. Question 1. Who did God use when he tested Abraham's faith? A. Joseph B. Ishmael C. Jacob D. Isaac You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, D. Isaac. Explaining the Bible, by faith Abraham, when he was tested, offered up Isaac, and he who had received the promises was in the act of offering up his only son. Hebrews chapter 11, verse 17. Question two, Lot chose to live near what city? A, Canaan, B, Merer, C, Bethlehem, D, Sodom. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, D. Sodom. Explaining the Bible, Lot chose for himself the whole plain of the Jordan and set out toward the east. The two men parted company. Abram lived in the land of Canaan, while Lot lived among the cities of the plain and pitched his tents near Sodom. Genesis chapter 13, verse 11 to 12. Question 3. Who told Abram to move to a new land? A. God. B. Sarai. C. Abraham's father. D. Hagar. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. A. God. Explaining the Bible. The Lord had said to Abram, Go from your country your people and your father's household to the land I will show you. Genesis chapter 12, verse 1. Question 4. Genesis chapter 19, verse 24 says, Then the Lord rained down on Sodom and Gomorrah from the Lord out of the heavens. A. Wind and rain. B. Burning sulfur. C. Large locust. D. Heaven and earth. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, B, burning sulfur. Explaining the Bible, Then the Lord rained down burning sulfur on Sodom and Gomorrah from the Lord out of the heavens. Genesis chapter 19, verse 24. Question 5. How old was Abraham when Isaac was born? A, 100 years old. B, 125 years old. C, 50 years old. D, 75 years old. You get 10 seconds. Correct. Answer. A. 100 years old. Explaining the Bible. Abraham was 100 years old when his son Isaac was born to him. Genesis chapter 21 verse 5. Question 6. What was the name of Isaac's wife? A. Ruth B. Rachel C. Rebecca D. Sarah You get 10 seconds.
Correct answer. C. Rebecca. Explaining the Bible. And Isaac brought her into his mother Sarah's tent, and he took Rebecca, and she became his wife, and he loved her. So Isaac was comforted after his mother's death. Genesis chapter 24 verse 67. Question 7. Name this scripture. Then the Lord said to him, Know for certain that for four hundred years your descendants will be strangers in a country not their own, and that they will be enslaved and mistreated there. A. Genesis chapter 1 verse 1. B. Genesis chapter 15 verse 13. C. Genesis chapter 13 verse 12. D. Genesis chapter 18 verse 13. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. B. Genesis chapter 15 verse 13. Explaining the Bible. Then the Lord said to him, Know for certain that for 400 years your descendants will be strangers in a country not their own, and that they will be enslaved and mistreated there. Genesis chapter 15 verse 13. Question 8. What does Ishmael's name mean? A. Father of many. B. Father. C. God hears. D. He laughs. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. C. God hears. Explaining the Bible. The angel of the Lord also said to her, You are now pregnant and you will give birth to a son. You shall name him Ishmael, for the Lord has heard of your misery. Genesis chapter 16 verse 11. Question 9. How old was Abraham when God changed his name and declared him a father of many nations? A. 100. B. 89. C. 75. D. 99. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. D. 99. Explaining the Bible. Abram was 99 years old when he was given the name Abraham, meaning father of many nations. Genesis chapter 17 verse 1 to 5. Question 10. Who did Abram take with him when he moved? A. His close friends. B. Lot. C. His mother. D. His father. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, B. Lot. Explaining the Bible. So Abram went as the Lord had told him, and Lot went with him. Abram was 75 years old when he set out from Haran. Genesis chapter 12, verse 4. Question 11. What does Isaac's name mean? A. Father of many. B. He laughs. C. God hears. D. Father. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. B. He laughs. Explaining the Bible. Abraham gave the name Isaac to the son Sarah bore him. When his son Isaac was eight days old, Abraham circumcised him, as God commanded him. Genesis chapter 21 verse 3 to 4. Question 12. What scripture did God say this to Abraham? Take your son, your only son, whom you love Isaac and go to the region of Moriah. Sacrifice him there as a burnt offering on a mountain I will show you. A. Genesis chapter 22 verse 2. B. Genesis chapter 15 verse 3. C. Genesis chapter 22 verse 5. D. Genesis chapter 15 verse 5. You get 10 seconds.
correct answer. A. Genesis 22, verse 2. Explaining the Bible. Then God said, Take your son, your only son, whom you love Isaac, and go to the region of Moriah. Sacrifice him there as a burnt offering on a mountain I will show you. Genesis chapter 22, verse 2. Question 13. How many generations are there between Abraham and Jesus? A. 14. B. 3. C. 8. D. 18. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, A, 14. Explaining the Bible. Thus there were 14 generations in all from Abraham to David, 14 from David to the exile to Babylon, and 14 from the exile to the Messiah. Matthew chapter 1, verse 17. Question 14. The story of Abram can be found in the book of A, Exodus, B, Revelation, C, Genesis, D, Matthew. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, C, Genesis. Explaining the Bible. The story of Abram, later known as Abraham, is recorded in the book of Genesis. Genesis chapter 11, verse 27 to chapter 25, verse 10. Question 15. What did God send to Pharaoh's household because of Abram's lie? A. Manna. B. Death. C. Fire from the sky. D. Sickness. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, D, sickness. Explaining the Bible, but the Lord inflicted serious diseases on Pharaoh and his household because of Abram's wife, Sarai. Genesis chapter 12, verse 17. Question 16. What happened to Abraham's son, Ishmael, after Isaac was weaned? A. He was sent away. B. He died. C. He was crowned king. D. He was jealous. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, A, he was sent away. Explaining the Bible, but God said to Abraham, do not be so distressed about the boy and your slave woman. Listen to whatever Sarah tells you, because it is through Isaac that your offspring will be reckoned. I will make the son of the slave into a nation also, because he is your offspring. Early the next morning, Abraham took some food and a skin of water and gave them to Hagar. He set them on her shoulders and then sent her off with the boy. She went on her way and wandered in the desert of Beersheba. Genesis chapter 21, verse 12 to 14. Question 17. What is Abraham referred to in James's epistle due to his faith? A. The disciple of God. B. The seeker of God. C. The follower of God. D. The friend of God. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. D. The friend of God. Explaining the Bible. And the scripture was fulfilled that says, Abraham believed God, and it was credited to him as righteousness, and he was called God's friend. James chapter 2, verse 23. Question 18. Abraham's birth name is A. Abel. B. Abram. C. Ishmael. D. Hebron. You get 10 seconds.
Correct answer, B, Abram. Explaining the Bible, the Lord had said to Abram, go from your country, your people, and your father's household to the land I will show you. Genesis chapter 12, verse one. Question 19, which is a reason for the separation of Abram and his nephew Lot? A, the quarreling between their men. B, they didn't like each other. C, God asked them to. D, the Red Sea divided them. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. A. The quarreling between their men. Explaining the Bible. And there was strife between the herdsmen of Abram's cattle and the herdsmen of Lot's cattle. Genesis chapter 13 verse 7. Question 20. God told Hagar to name her son. A. Abram. B. Ishmael. C. Isaac. D. Cain. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, B. Ishmael. Explaining the Bible, the angel of the Lord also said to her, You are now pregnant and you will give birth to a son. You shall name him Ishmael, for the Lord has heard of your misery. Genesis chapter 16, verse 11. Question 21. In what place did God scatter the people so he could confuse the language? A. Sodom. B. Haran. C. Canaan. D. Babel. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. D. Babel. Explaining the Bible. So the Lord scattered them from there over all the earth and they stopped building the city. Genesis chapter 11, verse 8. Question 22. What is the name of Abram's father? A. Serug. B. Terah. C. Laban. D. Nahor. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, B, Terah. Explaining the Bible, this is the account of Terah's family line. Terah became the father of Abram, Nahor, and Haran, and Haran became the father of Lot. Genesis chapter 11, verse 27. Question 23, Abram battled the army to rescue Lot. A, Elamite. B, Samoan. C, Egyptian. D, Philistine. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, A, Elamite. Explaining the Bible, when Abram heard that his relative had been taken captive, he called out the 318 trained men born in his household and went in pursuit as far as Dan. During the night, Abram divided his men to attack them, and he routed them, pursuing them as far as Hobah, north of Damascus. He recovered all the goods and brought back his relative Lot and his possessions, together with the women and the other people. Genesis chapter 14, verse 14 to 16. Question 24. Who turned into a pillar of salt? A. Hagar. B. Lot. C. Sarah. D. Lot's wife. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. D. Lot's wife. Explaining the Bible. But Lot's wife looked back and she became a pillar of salt. 
Genesis chapter 19, verse 26. Question 25. Abraham was a descendant of which of Noah's three sons? A. Japheth. B. Shem. C. Ham. D. Uber. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, B. Shem. Explaining the Bible, the sons of Noah who came out of the ark were Shem, Ham, and Japheth. These were the three sons of Noah, and from them came the people who were scattered over the whole earth. Genesis chapter 9, verse 18 to 19. Question 26. Abraham had six children with Keturah. Name two of them. Genesis chapter 25, verse 1 to 2. A. Kanye and Jay-Z, B. Cain and Abel, C. Madan and Midian, D. Ishmael and Isaac. You get 10 seconds. Correct. Answer, C. Madan and Midian. Explaining the Bible. Abraham took another wife, whose name was Keturah. She bore him Zimran, Jokshan, Medan, Midian, Ishbak, and Shua. Genesis chapter 25, verse 1 to 2. Question 27. Abraham was a wanderer. What is another name for his lifestyle? A. Nomadic. B. Canaanite. C. Egyptian. D. Western. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. A. Nomadic. Explaining the Bible. By faith, Abraham obeyed when he was called to go out to a place that he was to receive as an inheritance, and he went out not knowing where he was going. Hebrews chapter 11, verse 8. Question 28. Who went to live in the palace with Pharaoh when Abram and Sarai arrived in Egypt? A. Abram. B. Lot. C servant girl. D. Sarai. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. D. Sarai. Explaining the Bible. When Abram entered Egypt, the Egyptians saw that the woman was very beautiful. And when the princes of Pharaoh saw her, they praised her to Pharaoh. And the woman was taken into Pharaoh's house. Genesis chapter 12, verse 14 to 15. Question 29. Abraham had to find how many good men to save Sodom and Gomorrah. A. 10. B. 20. C. 30. D. 50. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, A, 10. Explaining the Bible, then he said, O oh, let not the Lord be angry, and I will speak again, but this once. Suppose 10 are found there. He answered, For the sake of 10, I will not destroy it. Genesis chapter 18, verse 32. Question 30. Where did Abraham build an altar to God on his way to what would eventually become Israel? A. Tyros on the east, Betharan on the west, B. Shiloh on the east, Geba on the west, C. Jezreel on the east, Megiddo on the west, D. Bethel on the east, Hai on the west. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, D. Bethel on the east, high on the west. Explaining the Bible. 
From there he went on toward the hills east of Bethel and pitched his tent, with Bethel on the west and I on the east. There he built an altar to the Lord and called on the name of the Lord. Genesis chapter 12, verse 8. Question 31. God told Abram three things, which was not true. A. I will be your God. B. I will bless those who bless you. C. I will send you to Egypt. D. Leave your country and go to the land I will show you. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. C. I will send you to Egypt. Explaining the Bible. The Lord had said to Abram, Go from your country, your people, and your father's household to the land I will show you. I will make you into a great nation, and I will bless you. I will make your name great, and you will be a blessing. Genesis chapter 12, verse 1 to 2. Question 32. Who did Abraham marry after Sarah's death? A. Talmai B. Keturah C. Hagar D. Bathsheba You get 10 seconds. Correct. Answer. B. Keturah Explaining the Bible, Abraham took another wife whose name was Keturah, Genesis chapter 25, verse 1. Question 33. What was the name of Abram's wife? A. Sarai. B. Ishmael. C. Sarah. D. Hagar. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, A, Sarai. Explaining the Bible, now Sarai, Abram's wife, had borne him no children. She had an Egyptian servant named Hagar. Genesis chapter 16, verse 1. Question 34. The name Abram means, A, the father is exalted. B, the father of time. C, the father of a multitude. D, the father of the people. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. A. The father is exalted. Explaining the Bible. Abram means the father is exalted. Genesis chapter 17 verse 5. Question 35. Egypt. How many children did Hagar bear for Abraham? A. 3. B. 2. C. 4. D. 1. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. D. 1. Explaining the Bible. And Hagar bore Abram a son, and Abram called the name of his son, whom Hagar bore, Ishmael. Genesis chapter 16, verse 15. Question 36. How many visitors came to Abraham's tent in Genesis 18? A. 3. B. 4. C. 1. D. 2. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. A. 3. Explaining the Bible. The Lord appeared to Abraham near the great trees of Mamre while he was sitting at the entrance to his tent in the heat of the day. Abraham looked up and saw three men standing nearby. Genesis chapter 18 verse 1 to 2. Question 37. How old was Abraham when Sarah died? A. 
100, B, 117, C, 137, D, 127. You get 10 seconds. Correct. Answer. C. 137. Explaining the Bible. Sarah lived to be 127 years old. She died at Kiriath Arba, that is, Hebron, in the land of Canaan, and Abraham went to mourn for Sarah and to weep over her. Genesis chapter 23, verse 1 to 2. Question 38. Abram's brothers were named and A. Nahor and Haran, B. Moses and Joshua, C. Nimrah and Canaan, D. Moaz and Gazez. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, A. Nahor and Haran. Explaining the Bible. This is the account of Terah's family line. Terah became the father of Abram, Nahor, and Haran, and Haran became the father of Lot. Genesis chapter 11, verse 27. Question 39. What did Abraham's son carry for his sacrifice? A. The wood. B. The knife. C. The fire. D. The rope. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. A. The wood. Explaining the Bible. And Abraham took the wood of the burnt offering and laid it upon Isaac his son. And he took the fire in his hand and a knife, and they went both of them together. Genesis chapter 22, verse 6. Question 40. Who visited Abram to tell him that he was going to destroy the city of Sodom? A. Angel. B. Hagar. C. God. D. Lot. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, C, God, explaining the Bible. Then the Lord said, Shall I hide from Abraham what I am about to do? Genesis chapter 18, verse 17. Question 41. What land did God tell Abram would be his? A, Italy. B, Egypt. C, Canaan. D, Africa. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. C. Canaan. Explaining the Bible. The Lord appeared to Abram and said, To your offspring I will give this land. So he built an altar there to the Lord who had appeared to him. Genesis chapter 12, verse 7. Question 42. What lie did Abram tell in Egypt that showed lack of faith? A. Sarai was his sister. B. That he was a rich man. C that he was the Messiah. D, to let his people go. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. A, Sarai was his sister. Explaining the Bible. Say you are my sister so that I will be treated well for your sake and my life will be spared because of you. Genesis chapter 12 verse 13. Question 43. What did Abimelech and the Philistines fill Isaac's wells with? A. Water. B. Sand. C. Manna. D. Rain. You get 10 seconds.
Correct answer, B, sand. Explaining the Bible. So all the wells that his father's servants had dug in the time of his father Abraham, the Philistines stopped up, filling them with earth. Genesis chapter 26, verse 15. Question 44. What type of animal did God replace for the offering of Abraham's son? A. Ram B. Sheep C. Lamb D. Goat You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. A. Ram Explaining the Bible. But the angel of the Lord called out to him from heaven, Abraham, Abraham, here I am, he replied. Do not lay a hand on the boy, he said. Do not do anything to him. Now I know that you fear God because you have not withheld from me your son, your only son. Abraham looked up and there in a thicket he saw a ram caught by its horns. He went over and took the ram and sacrificed it as a burnt offering instead of his son. Genesis chapter 22, verse 11 to 13. Question 45. How old was Abraham when he first became a father? A. 86. B. 93. C. 100. D. 79. You get 10 seconds. Correct. Answer. A. 86. Explaining the Bible. Abram was 86 years old when Hagar bore him Ishmael. Genesis chapter 16, verse 16. Question 46. Where was Abram born? A. Ur. B. Canaan. C. Egypt. D. Uz. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer, A, Ur. Explaining the Bible, Terah took his son Abram, his grandson Lot's son of Haran, and his daughter-in-law Sarai, the wife of his son Abram, and together they set out from Ur of the Chaldeans to go to Canaan. But when they came to Haran, they settled there. Genesis chapter 11, verse 31. Question 47. Abraham sent his servant to find Isaac A. A. Donkey B. Wife C. Friend D. Sheep You get 10 seconds. Correct. Answer. B. Wife Explaining the Bible The servant asked him, what if the woman is unwilling to come back with me to this land? Shall I then take your son back to the country you came from? Make sure that you do not take my son back there, Abraham said. Genesis chapter 24, verse 5 to 6. Question 48. When did Abram go to Egypt? A. When he was sick. B. When there was a famine. C. When he got married. D. When his father died. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. B, when there was a famine. Explaining the Bible. Now there was a famine in the land and Abram went down to Egypt to live there for a while because the famine was severe. Genesis chapter 12, verse 10. Question 49. Lot was Abraham's. A. Uncle B. B. Nephew. C. Brother. D. Cousin. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. B. Nephew. Explaining the Bible. This is the account of Terah's family line. 
Terah became the father of Abram, Nahor, and Haran. And Haran became the father of Lot. Genesis chapter 11 verse 27. Question 50. Who did Sarai tell Abram to marry so they could have a child? A. Esther. B. Eve. C. Hagar. D. Mary. You get 10 seconds. Correct answer. C. Hagar. Explaining the Bible. Now Sarai, Abram's wife, had borne him no children, but she had an Egyptian slave named Hagar. So she said to Abram, The Lord has kept me from having children. Go, sleep with my slave. Perhaps I can build a family through her. Genesis chapter 16 verse 1 to 2.